we have retreated deep into your body into a part of the world that few people get to see. The DNA Library. And all around you are books filled with the instructions that keep your body running. In front of you is a small selection to show off the chromosomes and the notable genes within them. Just look at any of the numbered books to learn about that chromosome. All right, so we are in the DNA chromosome library. Let's, uh, let's learn a little bit about some chromosomes. Your olfactory sense, the ability to smell and taste, is scattered across a wide variety of chromosomes. But one of the most interesting is OR6A2 on chromosome 11. Somewhere between 4 and 14% of people have a mutation on this gene huh. that causes cilantro to taste like soap. Who knew? Okay, close that one out. Let's go to, let's go to 16. The MC1R gene sort of on chromosome freaky. 16 determines the kind of melanin produced within your body. Theomelanin produces a red pigment seen in lips and some people's hair, while the more common eumelanin produces a darker pigment, responsible for black hair, brown eyes, and darker skin tones. Wow, okay. So the MC1R, now I know. Uh, how about the Y chromosome? The SRY gene found on the Y chromosome is responsible for the initiation of male sex characteristics in humans. Look at that little guy. It's like a Ken doll in a winter sweater. Okay, let's pick out one more random one. How about number eight? Chromosome oh. eight is responsible for the production of enkephalin a chemical that regulates our instinctive responses to intense negative stimuli like burns, cuts, and blunt force. Yeah, I gotta think that uh, hand in the fire, not a good idea. All right, well, thanks for uh, visiting the Chromosome Library in our Victory VR science curriculum. Uh, if you're interested in this, visit the Windows Store, the Oculus Store, or soon the uh, HTC Vive Store.